Welcome to Apothecarian's Toy Box. Before we get started, please do not forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share. Now, let's, now that we have that out of the way, let's go ahead and get into what I have for today. I have three different blind boxes. Um, first one that I have is actually a Minecraft minifigure blind box. Second one I have is from the Titans Vinyl Figures, the Alien Nostromo Collection. And the third is a newer blind box that I have went across and managed to get a handful of them. It's from a company, a newer company called Super Plastic, and it's the Janky Series 2 Art Toys or Art Collectibles. So, Let's go ahead and get into our first one. I'm gonna, let's go ahead and start off with the Minecraft minifigure. It is from series 20, the, the Dungeon series. All right. Okay. Here is our checklist in the Dungeon series. And as we have learned previously, sometimes just because it's not on the checklist doesn't mean it's not in the collection. I've gotten a, hand, I've gotten a few of these so far that have actually had many figures that weren't even on those checklists. We think it is. Oh, all right. It is the key golems. If you see those, it's actually kind of cool looking. I think myself. I can hold this up. They're right there. Again, there's not a number for a rarity that we know of on these. This is the key golem. Spin that around for you. This little keyhole. Basically, little keys with legs. and set that to the side. Next, we're going to go ahead and open up the Titans vinyl figure, which is the Alien Nostromo collection. Total of, I believe, I don't want to say, hang on. I constantly have to look to see what's here. I have uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. So I was thinking, okay. Some of them will tell you on the back, some of them don't. This has 16 figures to collect, ranging in rarity from a 2 and 20 to a 1 and 40. Now, let's go ahead and see what we have here out of our Titans box. I could not tell you what I have. It feels, if it is, then this is my third one of this particular, and this is getting kind of old if it is. So, it, again, it feels like he has a gun, and it, the top of his head, to be honest, feels kind of bumpy. And if it is, it's Parker. Let's see if I'm correct. Am I right? Am I right? No, thank goodness I'm not. It's a different one. All right. It's a completely different figure. Thank you. I was wrong. Sometimes it's good to be wrong, especially when I'm like, I don't want another Parker. Not that it's a bad figure, but I already have a hand, already have another one. I already have two, two of them. This one is actually Ripley. Put that down. Again, the arms are partially 
articulated and the head will move a little bit, not a whole lot because of her hair. I'll show you here which one we have. Right here we have Ripley. Ripley is a 2 and 20, which is supposed to mean that she's just more common, but this is the first one I've gotten of her. Go ahead and you can see. And there is some detailing on the back as well with the paint. Go ahead and stick her right here on her box. And she comes with a mini flamethrower gun. Let's see how well it'll actually fit in her arm. We have to do this one. It fits okay. See if it would work better in this one. Probably also help if the gun wasn't so bent. That's what happens when it's transported the way it is. It works out a little better that way. Here we go, we have Ripley. Ellen Ripley. And last, but definitely not least for today is the one I'm actually fairly excited about because I've never opened anything from this company before, in this company, Super Plastic. And this is the Janky Series 2 from Super Plastic. I'll let you guys have a look at the box. I'm not even going to pretend to count how many there are because when I get over to this side, the bottom, th like the bottom three have complete question marks as to their names or to their rarity. But I'm going, to, if there's just as many as there are that are listed, I guess listed out on the sides, I'm going to assume that there are, um, nine, 12, 15, probably at least 18. I'm assuming 18 different ones ranging in rarity. Let's see here if I can. Looks like ranging in rarity from a 2 and 24 all the way to a at least a known or written rarity of a 1 and 192 with the bottom three probably being even more rare than that. And as again, one of the things that I do like about this particular series of the Super Plastic, it says, this is not a toy, this is art. This is art. Because these are actually designed by artists who they have reached out to. Go ahead and open this up. So what is in this empty box? Okay, here we have the figure in the box. Before we get to that, looks like we have possibly a sticker. I'm not sure if this is going to be the one that it is or not. Super plastic. It's a picture of the one of the two and 24 it says Pete Fowler I think that is the designer of this particular one is Pete Fowler with the hashtag janky let's go ahead and get in to what is in here what's in here folks oh okay Sure there's something else. Oh, there is something else in here. Okay. So, what do we have? 
pretty interesting. Okay. Let me find it is Jor Ros. I think that is the name of the artist. Is Jor Ros. Let me show you. Right here. It's a 2 in 24. Basically, it is a as common as it could be for this particular series. So what, let's see what we have here. The head is articulated, like it'll move around. The arms are posable. Um, there's actually some really good movement on this. Really impressed by the movement. <laughs> there's just something on the something on the thumb right there, just kind of like a little blemish. And also, rather impressed with, are the feet. The feet actually move. So that you can actually, you don't have to have him completely in. You can have him one foot in, one foot out. You can pose him however you would like or pose her however you would like. And this particular one comes with an accessory. It's actually like a club. It's a spiked, like a spiked club or spiked baseball bat. And it says, ouch, on it. So let's see how well it'll actually fit. Seems to fit really well. All right, here we go. Go ahead and get that a little closer. Let you guys have a look at that. And as again, this is from the Janky Series 2, public or produced by Super Plastic. And this is the Joros figure. And I have a handful more of these. I hope to get more out of this set. Because again, like most of these figures look, I want to say not even most, all of these figures look really good. So this is a, I would, I'm going to say this is a good set to get. Very well done. All right, let's put this to the side. Okay, well, that's all I have for today. Um, please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and to share. And I hope to see you all next time. Have a great day.